We are collectively overconfident about our past. We are full of doubt about our present. And we don't believe in our future. Just think about it for a second and tell me how I'm wrong. We celebrate the past. We glamorize the past. We celebrate losses, celebrate the few wins. We magnify all the things we've accomplished in the past. But those things are just the roots of, our, of the tree that we have to now build. The tree isn't living on the ground. It's living above ground. When we talk about the present, we are constantly worried. We don't trust the government. We don't trust organizations. We don't trust each other. We are just full of doubt. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm over. I'm, by the way, optimistic through and through. But the problem is that I just think we have a collective lack of belief in our future. And I don't know where that comes from. Because individually, we're all doing fantastic things. We've all, you know, the Vatican is seeing, you know, an Armenian leader or an Armenian person every day in the last week. You know, we are present here. We are present in Venice. Everywhere we go, we are known, we are successful, we are celebrated. Except when we look at our future, eh, we kind of are afraid and are, we don't believe. And it's really hard to build a future if you don't believe in it. And notice I've said nothing about Armenia and the Armenian government, but if we come to that, that is present in Armenia and in, in Armenians. Because they tell themselves that, that, that they need to worry about the present so much that their doubt clouds their optimism about the future. You can't even get past the doubt about the present to think about the future.